Hi folks, Steven here. So, um, as a result of the recent announcement of Shadow Mewtwo in Pokémon Tournament, and uh, a thread I was reading on uh, a forum about hey, what kind of features would you want in an ideal Pokémon Home video release? Well, I did some research uh, just uh, for some of that, and it turns out that, uh, contrary to what some of you may think, the voice actor who played Mewtwo in Pokémon the first movie is actually still alive. So uh, the way I found this out was that um, I was reading through, and I found this interview from, believe it or not, last November. I, maybe I heard about this before, but this is the first time it really registered on me. Um, it's from this forum on this website called Behind the Voice Actors, and I'll put a link in the description. Uh, but it's with um, the guy who did the voice. Um, now, you may be a little confused here if you take a look at it quickly, but it turns out Philip Bartlett, the actual name used in the credits of the first movie, never really existed. Uh, it's actually an alias that was used by J.G. Um, unfortunately, his last name is a little bit beyond me in pronunciation. I found a few online, and I'm not willing to commit to one without knowing for sure. But in any case, uh, Jay's middle name is Philip. And at one point, he lived on a street named Bartlett, and that's kind of how, in the interview, how he explains where that uh, pseudonym came from. But a little more about him. Uh, he's done stage work. He's been an actor, he's been a director, and he also does some art-related stuff as well. Uh, the most recent uh, sort of job that I could find for him seems to be the Art Institute of Fort Lauderdale. He was an instructor there down in Florida. Um, he also does appear to have a website, and uh, you can check out some art there. I guess that leaves us one question. Uh, why the misconception? Why do people think Philip Bartlett was dead? Well, it turns out that Jay is from Minnesota originally. And someone who was from there, who had a name that was Philip Bartlett, spelled a little bit differently, um, died back in 2001. And somehow these got, uh, you know, uh, associated somehow. Um, and of course, you know, dying in summer 2001 would have explained why Mewtwo has a different voice in Mewtwo Returns and uh, why the voice is different in Smash Brothers Melee. Uh, but actually, the real story as to why they changed voices is, um, you know, Jay admits himself he didn't get along real great with the producers. Um, so, you know, after a while, they decided to move on to someone else. But if you want to know more, uh, take a look at the interview. It's in the description, um, and it's a good read. So I really do want you to uh, get the real story there. All right, folks, thanks.